Hello again and welcome back to my Handmade Cosmetics Reviews. It's great to see you all today. I have Vanilla Puff. So this is basically a deodorant powder. And I should give you a closer look in my hand. It essentially smells of Vanilla Delight. It's very, very similar. It's a really, really nice aroma. I really enjoy it. It's very much like Vanilla Cupcake kind of smells. Um, now putting this on, you ha you need absolutely hardly any. It really kind of goes on really, really well. I use it after I've had a bath, and look, I bought this back in August, and I've still got tons and tons and tons left. It's a lovely little product. Um, I have to admit, I don't use it all the time. It can be, if you're not in the right mood for that sweet smell, then it's it's not going to work. You have to. You know, like, I wouldn't have a bath with a twilight bath bomb, for example, and then use this afterwards because the, it just clashes and it just doesn't smell right. Yeah, I have tried that, by the way. Um, yeah, so you have to be in that kind of very sweety cake kind of kind of mood to appreciate vanilla puff. It's, it, well, I've said it already, it's very, very sweet. But I do love using it. It leaves your skin really, really silky smooth, which is odd for a talcum powder because essentially you're actually drying, you're drying your skin out when you use it. But I do enjoy this. Um, so, to be honest, I don't think I've got much more to say about it because I do really enjoy it. But I will tell you that it has one bottle of vanilla puff has one whole vanilla pod, which is about that long, in there. You don't actually see it, they've ground it up and, you know, it's part of the ingredients, but there's one per bottle of those, so it's, it is very, very vanilla-y, but it's very, it's of a sweet vanilla, it's cupcake kind of vanilla. Anyway, that is enough for me, thank you all for joining us today, I hope to see you soon. If you like what you see, subscribe, and I'd like to hear your comments, so see you again soon, bye-bye.